Hey guys, so I just got um, I just got the the lighting to digital AV, so I can uh, I'm gonna try to hook this up to my iPhone 6s, which is what I'm filming here. So I'm gonna try to hook this up, and then I'm gonna buy Filmic Pro. So I'm gonna buy Filmic Pro, and essentially this should allow me to have clean HDMI. Uh, out through this camera and into my computer so this should look a lot clearer and a lot cleaner than it does now as you can see it's once you start trying to look at things like this it just it's 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 unclear so hopefully this is going to work i don't know if it's going to work then when i hook it up to hdmi to my computer if that makes it any better so we're going to try that now Go to clean HDMI out, hardware, clean HDMI out, okay. Even though the M1 14 inch MacBook Pro has an HDMI port, the HDMI port is HDMI out. So it doesn't matter that I have the iPhone hooked up to the HDMI dongle, lightning dongle, with an HDMI cable going into the HDMI port on the computer because there's no HDMI in. So I've decided to buy a Cam Link 4K and I will hook that into this little USB-C dongle because the Cam Link is a, I think it's a USB, USB-A. So I will have the iPhone to the digital AV dongle to HDMI cord. The HDMI cord will go into the cam link and the cam link will go into the dongle and the dongle will go into the MacBook Pro. So that's where we're at. And I don't get that delivered till Friday. So that's where I am right now. Okay, so here's where we're at. iPhone 6S, Apple digital dongle. This I actually had. This is a QGM USB-C with USB 3.0. Are they both USB 3.0? So one USB 3.0, one USB 2.0. I actually had this in HDMI. So uh, the only thing that I, that I think I needed was the Elgato CamLink 4K. Here goes nothing. Okay, so just so we're clear, this is the dongle. I'm gonna plug this into the phone. I'm gonna unplug that because that's just going through the USB. So I'm gonna plug this into the phone. The, the HDMI cord is going to here, going in the cam link, into the QGM, into the USB 3.0 port. This other one is just the smaller camera. That's into the USB 2 port. And then this is the USB-C. It's gonna go uh, right where that white um, don't, little adapter is. Okay, so I set up the cam link. It seems to be working. I think it's I think it's clearer, but I'm not quite sure. So I'm gonna zoom in. I need to zoom in to see if can I zoom in here? No, I can't zoom in here. Interesting. So I can't zoom in on the phone. It looks like it might be clear, so I'm going to stop this and check it out. I'm going to zoom in on um, iMovie. So everything is working very well. I will say that the thing that I really, really hate is every time I turn on the phone, it starts in portrait mode. And there's no setting in the iPhone to be able to lock it to landscape mode. 
and there doesn't seem to be any setting in Filmic Pro to turn it landscape mode. They have horizontal flip, but that doesn't help me at all. So in order for me to film, every time I turn on the phone, I have to go like this, bring it down until it flips horizontal. Super annoying. Don't want to have to do that all the time, but I have no choice. Um, but, and it's working, it definitely looks cl more clear than it was before. So I am happy about that, at least. So we're moving, we're definitely moving, moving forward. My desk is a mess. All right, so we're gonna do a short recap. I have iPhone 6 pointing down at my iPad. Plugged into the iPhone 6, I have the Apple Digital Lightning to Digital AV. I will never get that right. Lightning to Digital AV dongle. Going into that, I have power with the lightning cord, and then I have HDMI. The HDMI cord goes haphazardly around the back of my computer and into the cam link, the Elgato cam link 4K. The HDMI, the HDMI is right there behind it. Uh, next to it, I have the small camera. So this little one right here is for this camera. Next to that, I have power, but I don't think that's doing anything because I needed to power my phone. So I tried to plug this in first. I don't think it's doing anything. That's just USB-C. I don't know why that's here. It's not even on. It's not even on on my USB thing. So cam link is going into the QGM. The USB camera is also going to the UGM. UGM is USB-C and that's going into my MacBook Pro um, via the, the Thunderbolt 4 USB-C thing. And it seems like it's working. Everything seems fine. So far so good. Um, so that is how I was able to set up my streaming system with an iPhone, a dongle, Camlink 4K, HDMI wire, the new 2021 MacBook Pro uh, 14 inch. And I'm so glad it's working because I had no idea what I was doing. Uh, just make sure that you have the Camlink because you need a capture card in order to get Filmic Pro to work for the video to go into the computer. Make sure you get a USB-C hub. And also I have this plugged into a USB 3. The Camlink 4K is into a USB 3. Um, that's probably important. The old cheap camera is going through the USB 2. I'm really glad that I had this old. Uh, I think I might have got this for like $30, the, the hub that's going into the computer. So it is possible. It works. I had so much trouble trying to figure out exactly how to do this online. Um, but now you've seen my failures and you've seen my successes. All right. Thanks for stopping by. Can't wait to live stream with this quality. Hopefully it's a lot better. Keep drawing and I will see you all in the next video. Peace. 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 Oh, let me just stop recording now. Thank you so much for watching the video. I really appreciate you. Be sure to like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Drug Free Dave. And don't forget to join my private Facebook group, Procreate Tutorials and Guidance. Check me out on Facebook. Hopefully I'll see you guys soon. And as always, keep drawing. And I'll see you in the next video.